Okay, so here are the recommendations that our group came up with uh, for this library. Uh, the first one is definitely more money needs to be put toward technology. Um, computers in particular, uh, one of our librarians noted that they could have twice the number of computers that they do now, and they would all still get used. Um, but just apart from that, more money being spent on hardware and software in general. Um, iPads and scanners for hardware, um, and just things like Photoshop or Dreamweaver as far as software goes. Um, another recommendation is that our library increase their hours. As of now, the library isn't open for very long outside of school hours. Um, it's open until from 8 to 4.30, so that doesn't give students very long before or after school to go to Now, obviously, uh, the fact that the library would have increased hours would also mean that it would need uh, more employees working. Um, and that's why our next recommendation comes into play, which is that the library should actively recruit volunteers to help staff it during the extra hours. Um, we are thinking the library can network with the PTA and with um, the local college system in the city um, to recruit their volunteers. That can students, uh, teachers, parents, just anybody that would be willing to contribute. Um, our last recommendation was based more on a qualitative observation than statistical data, um, but we did notice that certain subjects, history in particular, um, felt a bit lacking as far as the collection goes, and uh, so we recommend that the library encourage book donations and um, just do everything can to sort of beef up their collection in that area. Okay, so for the strengths of our uh, experience, first of all, the library that we worked with was extremely friendly and helpful and accommodating. Um, uh, that's probably because we had a bit of a connection to the library. Um, so everyone was very uh, eager to sort of participate in the project. Um, data was also really easy to collect. Um, students were cooperative. Um, and our group worked well together. Uh, sort of roles were delegated very easily. There wasn't really any friction between members. Uh, overall, it was a very easy going experience. Now, uh, the experience was completely painless. Uh, we did feel that we had a few weaknesses that could have possibly been addressed. Um, for one, just there, there was such a short period of time to collect data. Um, if we had sort of a longer range of time, we felt like our results could have been even better. Um, we were a little worried that our questions could have been more exact uh, as it stands now. They were perhaps a little bit general. Um, finally, we sort of realized afterward that we missed the boat as far as just having a question about overall satisfaction with the library um, on like a 1 to 10 scale. And that way, we'd have kind of a numerical measure of people's overall satisfaction. Hello, I'm Samantha Smith, and I'm going to conclude our presentation um, by showing you the appendixes. So we'll start with the teacher survey um, for which we used five questions. Um, first is how often do you take your classes to the library and we gave them a couple options to answer. Um, second was do you incorporate the library's resources in any of your assignments and we offered yes or no and if yes how often. For the third, we asked, overall, how helpful are the media specialists at the library? And gave them a couple options to answer. And for the fourth question, um, we asked, other than your assignments and classes, for what else do you use the library? And we gave them a couple options there. And for the fifth, we left it more open-ended and asked them to list any resources they might like to add that 
perhaps we didn't think of. For the student survey, um, we asked five questions again, um, a similar format to the teacher survey. We asked, um, do you use the library? And gave them a few options to answer. Um, for the second question, we asked, what services do you use in the library? And they could answer as many of them as they used. Um, for the third, we asked, what services would you like the library to improve? And we left that one open-ended for anything they might think of. Um, for the fourth, we asked, what genres do you enjoy reading the most? And they could circle uh, whatever they wanted there. And for the fifth, we asked, what is the last book you checked out from the library? And they could put down whatever that book was. For our media specialist interview questions, um, we put together two sections, um, an organizational needs questions and personal needs questions. Um, these would be used to get a better idea of um, what the media specialist um, need in the library for um, overall work and also for their personal work. And this concludes our presentation of our needs assessment. So thank you for watching and hope you enjoyed it.